Welcome to another Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders! So, last time I was finding out that we were actually dealing with the zombie apocalypse. So, I'm gonna uh, try to save our poor nun who was who has fallen ill from the plague after uh, trying to take care of our poor patients that became zombies. So let's load up the file. Alright. So, um, before I go off, I'm gonna go ahead and... And actually, uh, if anyone saw the last attempt at a stream I just did, uh, I actually went through some of this already, but I'm going to rebuild the ro this room into a the alchemist room, but it is kind of small, so let me see if I can rework it real quick. into there so it can be used instead of the alchemist I mean the, the cauldron so we can get better recipes be uh, worked on by our lovely Garontius alright did that work? I think I still need that table back on there huh? so I'm going to put that table Back, just in a different spot than where it was before. Let's see. Where did it? There it is, my little small tables. I got so many now. Yes. Okay. So this creates the Alchemist Laboratory. Where we will now have better craftables by residents. Yay! Be happy, y'all. Clap, clap, clap. Alright. So now to find the Holly Hawk, because we must save her. We can't just kill her like she says. Kill me! <laughs> Alright. So we're gonna go ahead. Well, actually, before we go, I want to do this. Uh, before we go so we have more room in our pockets. <laughs> I'm going to see what I can empty out into like decoration or maybe even how I'm gonna just dispose of it or put it into like another chest. <laughs> Beer barrel. <sighs> you can get drunk in here, right? <laughs> right there. Stop doing that. <laughs> uh, fish dish. Ooh, dragon bones. How big is that? That's so big. Maybe in the watering room. That's kind of creepy. Can I put it in the water? That's gross. <gasps> no. <laughs> I can't just throw it in the water. That would have been funny. Mm -hmm. There we go. It seems appropriate in here. <laughs> Alright, what else can we throw down? Because I want space! Towel rail, so... Maybe in the kitchen? Our very, very tiny kitchen. We should totally <laughs> upsize it. This is because of the original design, right? From the plans. But I think we could totally make it bigger or later. But there's so many more chapters and I do want to get through them all, so I, I mean it's not spend forever on the building. 
when we know that we're not going to take anything with us in the next chapter. Sniffle. Mm -hmm. So considering how easily I filled up my pockets, I'm, maybe that's a good thing. <laughs> say that. Candelabrium. Alright, so I'm gonna put that somewhere. Yay! <laughs> Does it add a little fanciness to the water room? Alright, what else do we want to throw around? That sounds gross. <laughs> Oh, why is this in my inventory? It's gross. Can I just plant this outside instead? Ew. I don't want this. <laughs> why would I? There we go. Just keep it outside. That's disgusting. Anything else I want to just throw outside? Oh, these flowers. I don't want them. Take it! You can have these! I guess the trees can't grow out here. Makes sense, it's a dead area. <laughs> Alright, what else can we throw out? I'm guessing these are special, because I got one of each. Let's see what else we can do. Can I just toss this out here? I guess I could eat this. <laughs> Let's swap it. Go away! Alright. French fries. I had so many potato chips today. <laughs> potatoes. Maybe a Panda Body 2020. <laughs> night, night. <sighs> oh yeah, he's still waiting for that hollyhock. So he's got the icon. as I need it, but what else can I do? I mean, the calls are with me. But I could probably just shove it over here for now. Same for this. Until needed. Excuse me. <laughs> what can I see? What else? Oh, the ballista. Do I have room up there for a second ballista? No, I made room for one, right? And... Oh yeah, I should probably put the other one on the other side. And then that gives me use for this, right? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I wonder if we're gonna get any stronger materials soon. Although, I'm more worried of fact that if our thing's gonna be going upwards as we play. Let me make this where it's kinda easy to get to here. So we've got ballistas on both sides. I don't know if we want to make it where they can have like 20 more, but it's something. Just kind of shove it like that. Boom! Dish as a decoration. 
Ooh, the magic door. <laughs> Let's get some more points on our doors. We don't need all these straw doors, right? Yeah. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> My gut, I'm going after her. <laughs> Goodbye, Elle. I will put you out of your misery. I'm kidding. Alright. <laughs> Yay! Now it comes with extra points. Alright. I kind of want to be like, oh, I can put some tables in here and, and you could get oops, <laughs> some food on there or something. They keep asking for food. Let's see. More tables everywhere and throw things on them. Here, food. <laughs> Ew. It probably would stink after a while. Put that there. And put that there. And this here. <laughs> we're gonna figure out if there's any more items we can throw on them. Yeah. All right. What can we work with? Throw this everywhere. Um, is there any more one-offs that we can play with? There. Uh, chains. Because being sick is like you're chained down to the infirmary. <laughs> like that? <laughs> space in there in case there's another teleportal. I don't know how many of those gonna be. There's always room in here for decoration. What should we do? You know, it makes sense for another wash tub here, right? <laughs> it is the bath. It's the only bath. <laughs> I hope they're clean in my bath. I better not stink up my bath. And pull my microphone out. <laughs> Alright. What else can we move? I need space! I want to collect more things! No, we don't need this. Or this. Or this, honestly. I just throw these outside. I don't want them like in one place. It could be like randomly outside. <laughs> totally not matching. I mean, I guess you could kind of say it was maybe a previous area. Oh, yeah, we need a. This is the graves for the three people we lost. <laughs> we need rest in peace. Our poor zombies. Alright. It's like. Pop proper memorial for them and I don't want all these seeds like it doesn't benefit me huh like why do I want grass I guess if I wanted like a garden <laughs> I got to actually <gasps> oops they weren't ready were they oh no where's the undo button it wasn't ready <laughs> Starting. <laughs> okay, okay. I'll do that. I have more important business. I screwed up my farm. <laughs> I don't even remember what I planted. I just. I probably three of each. Hmm. Hard fruit. I don't know how long they take, but maybe on my quest by the time I get back. <laughs> they look the same, so I'm 
gonna guess that it was. At least some of them. Does it say how many days they take on here? Or does it just tell you that that's a seed? Oh, there's no description right next to it. I need to actually. Oh. Maybe I should look there. It doesn't tell you. Plant in. Oh, shoot. That's why, duh. Golden water. Oh my goodness. So this won't work anyways. My bad. them here. But I need the rake. Which is a regular item. Oh, this bucket. Oh, yeah, that's right. This is for water. And... Oh, no! Wait, so how would I do it? to make that into like grass first Stuff. Oh, I get that. What the heck? Yeah, I really didn't make this up, or didn't I? It feels like it's floating. It's probably on top of something. But what? Maybe it's just that egg. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna make the dados. I'll worry about heart fruit and um, planting later. We're gonna make more potatoes! <laughs> that makes me sad though. So that was like futile. Alright, let's see. Where is our. Oh, we have a whole bunch of these. Spot. French fry. What else can we do to get rid of all this excess space? Cause I want to collect where we are next. <laughs> Man, I'm actually running low on wheat. Huh? Oh, well, I guess I got a lot of potted plants. We can throw those on the tables too. What else? We could throw these lights all over. It doesn't have to be like on the outside, it could be on the inside. Help oh, navigate at night. Okay, I might have to go to sleep before I continue all this. 
redecorating. There we go. And oh yeah, that's right. It's over at the watering place. I got some tables there. Boom! Decorated. Boom! Decorated. Why does it get to level five? Oh, nothing. <laughs> I guess it just makes it easier to pass the last part. What they're asking. Uh, and it's extravagant table for extravagant needs. Like I don't know. I really don't need this table. I don't have room. Oh. I might start building up for the next chapter. <laughs> like, just for space reasons. Ooh, that's a lot. It's a dining area! I don't know. <laughs> it's just not the best design. Oh no! Leave me alone! I'm going to bed now! Sleeping. Totally asleep. Now you can't hit me. <laughs> that's how it works, right? these giant tables is there things I could throw on there <laughs> hmm. I guess I should put this like leather sack close to not the leather sack sorry this <laughs> could be close to Oops. and oh, look at all this yummy food Oof. Makes me hungry. <laughs> I would love some. There we go. It's got leather sacks. Oh, <gasps> level up! Yeah, I figure so. With all this junk, I totally snatched from like everywhere. <laughs> It doesn't matter if it levels up or not. It makes it feel more treasury, right? <laughs> Ooh, all right. Uh, I don't know what else. More beds. We could always use more beds, right? Some people could totally sleep in the water room. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where I would put more beds. I don't know if that's actually another option here. It would be crazy cramped. Oh no! The rain! The only other place I could think of is if you're like crazy enough to sleep here. Yes, for the crazy people who want to sleep next to the water. It's a sick room! Okay. Is that better than a watering hole? <laughs> I have a gazillion pots! <laughs> I don't know what to do with it. I will stick them all the way. This couch that doesn't fit in. Dares ruin my son. Where, where are they? Where are they? Where is that son of a biscuit? <gasps> you guys! Why? No! <laughs> you jerk! <laughs> really? 
Oh wait, what am I doing? <laughs> I need a weapon! You cut forever. Don't destroy my wings! That was horrible. My cell room. Spare weapons. I'm gonna make some more axes. Cause mine's almost broken. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Do I have this? No. Oh, I should get this. Once my armor breaks out of work. Or if I'm over dealing with a really ridiculous monster. Ooh. Blade. It sounds like it'd be, it'd be really nice. 25 versus 30. Well, Iron Axe is definitely the strongest so far, it looks like. I like playing with the sword more. A little more. I got all this space to collect with soon. So, I got to have all these butter beans. I may as well just eat them all. <laughs> Where's the kitchen? Oh, I kind of just want to leave them there for now. Decoration. Mm, Alright. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead at this point. I think I have a pretty good size of inventory space. Anything else you want to throw around? Maybe these doors or tables and stuff. Probably don't need this fancy carpet. <laughs> I'm excited. Better used and stuff with me. Oh, this is the green grass. Green grass. And green grass. Hello. I'm just trying to use up all my items so I can have space <laughs> to collect more items as I venture on. Put this here. It's a prison. <laughs> so torture the zomb the people, the zombies once they become zombies. <laughs> Lock them up so that way they don't attack us. <laughs> All right. I feel like I'm pretty good. I got keys for that vault that we need to find. Throw these outside because they suck. I don't want them. At least not here. Oh, my grave. With the poor I lost so much I almost got myself killed by my own. <laughs> I.
gonna go now. Alright, now to the story mission. Now that I got all the rooms to collect all the things. <sighs> Let's see. We're going this way. Stay up top. Because last time I was in the bottom, I was getting attacked by way too many zombies at one time. <laughs> Before some ghosts or chimera or something, or poison zombies attack me in the park. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Don't hit me! I'm just. Well, I kind of made this little. I didn't realize it was not touching the wall. Oh shoot! <laughs> the zombie knows how to climb stairs! <laughs> it's too smart! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Go away! Get off my stairs! Oh no! Get off my stairs! It's too dark! <gasps> what the heck? What was that? The zombie did like some crazy move right there. Okay. I'm alive. I need to get back on the stairs. Zombies climbing stairs. And apparently they climb them really fast. That's not me. <laughs> So where am I going? Okay, so I'm over there. And I totally was confused the first time I looked at the spot. <laughs> don't think I need those. What happened to that armor I picked up for? Oh, I worked with earlier. Yeah, I can just. Okay. So, I really don't need this anymore. 
some of the strong stuff. That's what I worked on. Um, I don't want the shovel right now. Poison. I totally should have used that. No, that's confusion. Wait, don't I have the one for poison? Oh, that's frost. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay. So now we must return. I know I have to exit outside first. Oh, wait. Shh, I'm poisoned! <laughs> okay. Now I can return and I will not die on the way there. I want this door. Just let me know. I can totally make that a thing afterwards. Be cool to get the platinum for this game. Oh, maybe I should have grabbed like one more just so that way it would have been nice things. I'm kind of mad at myself now. I, I think I'm gonna match this order. I should at least <laughs> do this. <laughs> there we go. Kind of wanted me to all be in that way. Let's see.
they're just gonna climb over the <laughs> they probably will Go ahead and talk to Gorontius. We got his hollow hawk. Holly hawk. Holly hawk. Holly hawk. I don't say this. You found it, Jenny? You found the holy hawk. Now that we have this, we can finally create the medicine that can cure my darling L. That's right, L is his granddaughter. Hmm, or can we? It would seem that one single holly hawk will not be enough to produce the medicine we need. You're so close, Geely. Is there really no solution to this problem? Think, Gorontius, think! Oh, 
My transmutation table is totally floating. Hollyhock say! We must grow it! Don't screw this up, Jeely! <laughs> Hrump! Had an idea, have you, young lady? Well, spit it out then! Hrump! 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 Hmm, 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 hmm! I say, Jeely, that just might work. I should have known you'd be able to come up with a plan. We simply need to retrieve the seeds from the hollyhock we already have and use those to grow new flowers. And then by using the farming technique that the great sage the lame has perfected, we can grow as many as we need. Yes, if we do this, we'll be able to craft the divine draught after all. Quickly then, Geely, retrieve the hollyhock seeds from the flower and then plant them in the veggie patch. And when you've grown enough flowers, use the transmutation table to brew the divine draught. And once the medicine is complete, give it to Elle and cure her of this dread disease. After I eat this. Nom nom! <laughs> and eat this. Because <laughs> I'm starving! I thought I should have got a cup of water before I started this. <laughs> I'm not so thirsty! <laughs> Alright. Alright, so now it made two seeds. Is it really just gonna be like two at a time? Or is those two gonna make a lot? Anyways, I guess that's a good enough reason to get rid of some of these potatoes then. <laughs> sleep until those are done. Man, what if he like accidentally hit them? He would've been bad, right? <laughs> night, night! Grow! Please, grow! <laughs> and... <gasps> are they done? Or did they take another days? I don't know if that's done. I kind of want to just sleep another day to be safe. <laughs> See if they will grow any differently. Yeah! I'm glad I waited. One more day for safe measure. <laughs> Alright, so I think that's full bloom. So it takes two nights. Oh, yay! We produced a bunch of them. And then let's go ahead and make some more. <laughs> Go with your crazy plans. <laughs> and we'll have all the hollyhock seeds and hollyhocks. I don't want to run out in case I gotta make multiple of these. Five of them, so I'll just go ahead and rest for another day. Well, two days. <laughs> night, night. One, two. Oh my goodness, lady. <laughs> the bed's over there. Got enough. <laughs> oh, I don't want to eat Hi! So I am going to make a few of these to throw in the trunk. Just 
bears. <laughs> I don't want to just move them to keep going. Now we don't have one, but we have 60 of them! We should have enough for the ingredients now. Probably way more. I only need five. I'm an overachiever! <laughs> Let's go ahead and grow these two. Alright. Now I'm going to... Recipe now. Let's make the honey pot into our new medicine. So we can save poor L. If everyone would get out the way. <laughs> Alright. What? Ah! <laughs> and now I'm out of liquid silver! Okay. What do we need to make liquid silver again? I think it's right here, right? It's getting crowded in here. Was it the... Ugh. Oh, the world was made. Somewhere. Wait, was it made in there? Oh, you need the fish for the, the tingle? That's the tingle tablet. Was that the... Which fish was it? <laughs> That's one with the paralysis, right? So for the paralysis, one, uh, the fish was like uh, near the, the f yellow flowers on the edges, so you can get them there. So it's close to the killer nest. <laughs> Alright, let's Welcome. All right, we can finally save L. Live. <laughs> what was that? Julie, you created a cure just for me. Oh, my lamb! I was dreaming. I jumped. I saw the Hades condor. That awful bird. Thanks to you, we have con c conquered so many sicknesses and saved so many people from the blight. If we could only slay the Hades Condor in turn, we could clear the darkness from the sky and return the light to Remoldar. Please, Geely, destroy that foul beast. This is the font of all the pain and misery in this land. Yes, we will. You need that. In the meantime, I gotta talk to you. Geely! Oh, Geely, you have saved my L! Thank you. I can't tell you how much this means to me. Geely, uh, uh, was wrong. When Ilias took his research down the wrong path, I abandoned him. I forsook my own apprentice and left him to die. I made excuses for myself. I lectured anyone who would listen about the dignity of accepting death and all manner of philosophical sophistry. But in the end, I couldn't sit by and watch while my dear sweet granddaughter wasted away. Gee, I, I was a fool. What? Yes, I remember now. You said the same thing when we first met. Though it may be foolish to rebel against our fates, that is what makes us human. There is wisdom in your words. Though seeing them spout from such a dopey face is really rather vexing. Hey! Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Well, by the time we wake up tomorrow morning, El should be fully recovered. I think you've earned yourself a good night's sleep too. In the morning, I suggest you check up on El and see how she is. Hopefully she won't be a zombie! <laughs> Thank you again, Geely. Words cannot express how truly grateful I am. Oh no, it's time for Bato. Really, before she sleeps? What in the world was that tremendous shaking? No, it can't be. Oh, the Hades Condor. You know, I think I revived her before that. I don't want her being in a sick bed while we're fighting. 
Come, Elle, join us. I hope. Yay! Welcome back. <laughs> Let's talk. Oh, hello, Jeannie. Thanks to you, I'm fit as fit as a fiddle again. I can only apologize for the things that I said to you when I first fell sick. I was a coward. But when you took me in your arms and laid me to rest in that bed, in the sick room that we built together, I felt somehow fulfilled. Thank you, Julie. Thank you so much for saving me. Alright, let's wait. I, I want to use this. <laughs> Yay! More health! I got so much health now. <laughs> and I probably should have some more food on hand in case my character just gets hungry again. Butter beans. There's always that. I'm sure there's more food in here. Thanks, you guys! <laughs> Alright, so if I get hungry mid battle, I'm good. I feel like I need better walls. <laughs> Do I even have a way to build better walls yet? <laughs> I feel like I don't. Oh, this is what I needed that other time. I'm gonna have this on hand in case. I'm tired of all these status effects. Sock. <laughs> so. I uh -huh. I can't do anything else with this. <laughs> should we or should we not? I'm gonna save first, just in case this turns out to be really messy of a battle. Go ahead and let's do this battle. And if it sucks, then we probably need better defenses. <laughs> Chili, the monsters are coming. A vast host is descending upon our town. We have cured so many diseases and even formulated the divine drop by which this land might be saved. Unfortunately, it looks like our hard work has ruffled the Hades condor's feathers. The beast means to destroy our town and everything in it. Come, Chili. The battle for Mamoldar's heart and soul is finally at hand. Once we dispatch its underlings, we will be free to face the Hades Condor itself. Incidentally, Geely, have you spoken with Elle since she awoke? She'd have a fit if she knew we were going to war without her. What do you say, young lady? Are you ready to embark on this final battle? This is the final one? Okay. Yes. If anything, I'll learn how to do this correctly. <laughs> I have to listen. Come at me! Actually, I have a little idol y'all can come to. Come on, come here, come here! Yay! <laughs> this is great. Just stand right here. That's awesome. Aw, this is my friend. <laughs> I have some good villagers. Thanks, y'all. Yes! Leave them towards my idol! This is awesome! Nice. Alright, what's phase two gonna have? Please don't break my wall. Oh, okay. Well, as long as nothing that can break my wall easy. Oh, they poison, so let me get my new armor. Let's see, I don't need this. I need this right now. I rather have stats if it's healing. Poison! And. Yeah. Oops, here we go. So I'm going to. Let's see, I'm currently wearing one for confusion. I'm gonna switch this for the one with poison. Ooh, I'm gonna that. Oh no! Zombie! <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
have to fight them all over there? The Walking Dead. But at least the Walking Dead can't break doors, right? Uh. Come here, y'all. Zombies don't like fire, right? Oh, that barely does anything now. I'm gonna fight you from right here. So you Whoa! What is that? <laughs> oh, you? Did all those? I think that was multiple. <laughs> Go! At least I have so much help. <laughs> hey! Don't make all my people get poisoned. You jerk. Boom! Oh, lame. Oh no! Why? The one thing I wasn't protecting right now. Oh no! Wow, I can't aim. Oh no! <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, there's an invisible wall there or something. Mm -hmm. uh, this isn't fair, they're not gonna go that way. And apparently my character can't throw a straight to save a life. Okay, fine. I'm gonna do this for you guys, because apparently this coward doesn't want to fight us <laughs> directly. Lame. So I have to be the hero sometimes. <laughs> the day of destiny is finally upon us, Geely. If we can only defeat these last few monsters, I know that Ramoldar will be delivered from the darkness and light will return to us all. Let us all fight together and show these evil bits our true strength. I'm sorry, Julie. I'm so sorry. I want to help you fight off the monsters. I really do, but the minute they show up, my legs seem to carry me away of their own accord. The human body really is a mystery thing, isn't it? Then you can work the the ball <laughs> ballista ballistas. <laughs> so when we fight the these condor, just do that while I jump up and attack it like a crazy person. <laughs> It looks like I'll have to leave the fighting to you. Uh, everyone left the fighting to me at the end of that last round. <laughs> They're like, nope, nope, nope. Go on, Geely. Beat up all the monsters. And bring back the light. <sighs> Alright. It looks like the monsters have finally pulled their fingers out. This has got all the hallmarks of being the final fight for Mulder's heart and soul. Don't give up, Geely. Give it your all and show that Hades Condor who's really the boss around here. It might not be the right time to ask these sort of questions, but I'm going to go ahead and do it anyway. Have you been making good use of the metalworking tips I gave you? Metal weapons and armors are nice and strong, so they'll serve you well in battle. You're going to need all the edge you can get in a fight like this, and metal weapons held a good edge, I can tell you that much. I guess I could at this point just switch to wearing the better armor. Let these go away. May as well. Switch to good armor. Alright. And we'll probably rest one more time before the battle. Night night! for the next round. I hope that my current wimpy fort will be enough. <laughs> Impressive work, Geely. You certainly made short work of those monsters. But your task is not over yet. Even more of the Hades Condor forces bear down upon us. I won't let you fight those blighters alone, Geely. Let's show them a thing or two together. 
Well, young lady, are you ready to face the next wave? Yes. Effective against these evil caterpillars. <laughs> Come at me. I got armor for you. There's zombies. Oof. I'm just like working now. I'm just for that thing, easy decoration of those things out. I'll take care of that one, I'll take care of this one. And I got five tingle tablets. It's too bad I can't use items on them as far as I can tell. Crazy town. <laughs> oh, I can't stand that Hades condor. Elle's barely back on her feet, and it's already trying to barge his way in here and kill us all. Gee, have you built those ballistas yet? The ones we all invented together? Yeah. The Hades condor flies to the sky, so you'll need to fire them pretty high up if you want to hit it. Make sure you got all your ballistas set up before you take on that big bird brain, all right? Yeah, I probably won't put some on the other sides. <laughs> this might not be high enough. Thank you. 
so I'm gonna get some more building blocks. to fight the Hades Condor. Ooh, popcorn. <laughs> I want some snacks too. I bought a lot of snacks today. This up here. I don't know what direction. I was trying to figure out how to empty my uh, colossal coffer and just started shoving everything <laughs> in the rooms. So I could have space to collect more things. The annoyed of it saying, It's full! <laughs> Alright, so I got four ballistas around. I hope that's enough. We're gonna find out if that works. All right, so I'm going to get ready to see what this battle's like and make changes accordingly if I really have to. Good work, Geely. Another band of the Hades Condor's underlings have been defeated. We need only... Hold out a little longer. This next assault may well be the last before the beastly bird takes matters into its own talons. But only if it can cut down its minions first. Well, Geely, are you ready to do battle? Let's do it. Please don't include him. Oh. <laughs> sure, it's trees! Come! Get burnt! Your trees! Wow, oh, that doesn't do much damage. Alright. Stay right there. Yes, all y'all come at me. <laughs> In front of this thing. Oh, it gives me fruit. <laughs> Instead of wood. And now I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry! They're like self sufficient. Alright. Oh. Ha! I have protection against your crazy confusion spells. I'm ready. I'm ready. Really good armor. Go! I'm so glad I. Another of this sword. Them. Whoa, I'm gonna have a lot of health. I'm gonna put you down last. So I can all concentrate on you. I'm gonna use my axe here. Chop, 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 chop. Yeah. Be great, you know, if you just keep attacking them. <laughs> they just keep those while you're attacking the back. Oh, that, never mind, that thing went away. Here we go. Let's go to the side. I'm getting this easy now. <laughs> you can beat up the hunting scene. Thank you! Ooh, got my butt burned. <laughs> Victory! Alright.
Okay, is this it? Are we about to face the Hades Condor? After I go to bed. <laughs> I am totally ill. The day of destiny is finally upon us, GD! If we can only defeat these last few monsters, I know that Remolder will be delivered from the darkness and light will return to us all. Let us all fight together and show these evil beasts our true strength. I thought they said the last one was the... Oh, I don't know anymore. Sleep! Get ready! Alright, here we go. What do they give me? Oh, I don't want no flipping trees. Y'all can have this tree. Take it back. <laughs> Well, seeing as they turned into zombies before, I guess they'd rather fight now before they are inevitably becoming zombies. <laughs> it might be the cure. Oh, yeah, this might be it. It's got a different uh, sign on this head. Okay, let me check my armor and my weapons. I should swap out some of this stuff, right? <laughs> like, I don't need this. I could use that. Don't need that. Switch to that. I'm keeping these status effects ones. I wish I had another slot for poison. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, as nice as that sounds, I guess it's kind of useless. What is darn sweet? Hope I built high enough. If not, we will find out. And I will die. <laughs> it might not be the right time to ask these sort of questions, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway. Have you been making good use of the metal working tips I gave you? Metal weapons and armors are nice and strong, so they'll serve you well in battle. You're gonna need all the edge you can get in a fight like this, and metal weapons hold a good edge, I can tell you that much. Well done, Geely. The Feather Fiend's followers are no more. All that's left is the Hades Condor itself. The roots of the blight that grips our land and the darkness that enshrouds it. Slay it, and the light will return. But remember, young one, the beast is known to fly through the air, far out of reach of any sword or axe. You must use the ballista your friends invented to shoot it from the sky. Place these weapons high above the ground and unleash their full force the moment your enemy lets his guard down. Well, Geely, are your preparations complete? don't know, but I want to know exactly how high is this supposed to be, if this is enough. You are not alone, young lady. We will fight by your side and slay the sickness spreading. What? You're going to fight it alone? Very well, if you fear that, we will only get in the way. I defer to your judgment. Uh, what? What? Hold on, I don't want to fight it alone. <laughs> no, Julie, no! <laughs> I wanted them to, like, handle the others. <laughs> I got four ballistas, not one. <laughs> Now go, Julie! Slay the Hades Condor and restore light to the land of Remoldor! I wanted them to be the scapegoat! This ain't code. Granted, I guess this is inevitable considering they just got screwed like last time. Bye! Well, they got taken away like last time, so. I think there would have been a choice in this part of what- Maybe she mentioned it because she remembered how what happened last time. <laughs> Alright, so uh, let's see if I can survive this. If I even have a setup for this. 
correctly. Oh no! <laughs> oh, lovely. I'm gonna destroy my place before I even get to it. I worked hard to build this place, you jerks! <laughs> I guess I destroyed my own village. This is lame. Who knows what they're destroying now? It's calling for backup. Meanwhile, I haven't even like gotten to it yet. Ah, oh. how am I supposed to aim this when it only goes one direction? I guess I'm not gonna get a chance unless those guys are dead, so... Let's do this. Whoa! What is this area on the outside? Poison water immediately. Oh no! It would be the one ailment I did not protect myself from! <laughs> are they all going from the side? Or no? Okay, this is new. I didn't know it was gonna be this way. How would I know this? Wait, is this... I don't think I built it high enough, like, even if I did. Maybe. First I need to put some stuff out of my pocket so I can actually have it. Every area. Mm -hmm. This is probably not the best uh, setup. <sighs> oh, come on! By the time I get up on these places, it's. Oh, this sucks. Why are these this Melissa setup is like it only in its one direction, it's not like you can turn it while you're using it. And you have to put it down. Oh, there goes the dragon bones. I didn't destroy my entire place. That sucks. What is crap? Come on you guys. This is irritating, like it takes me so long just to get figure out where the heck it is. Wow, it takes so long for this thing to recharge, too. And then I have to keep going back to fight these guys. I shouldn't have done anything. Okay, where the heck is it now? See, this isn't fair. <laughs> By the time I can find it, it's gonna start over again, see? What? How do these work? This is horrible. <laughs> I hate this. Like, can I use better weapons for freaking range attacks? This is dumb. <laughs> you have to use the ballista that you can't freaking, like, turn and navigate while you use it. Like, this is so lame. Wait, how do I get poison? I'm still wearing that immunity. Like, this isn't. Like, this it protects against. Oh, wait, that's frost. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking frost is not confusing. Oh my god, y'all are destroying my home. <laughs> Talk about this place, Kondo is doing all this crap on me. 
Well, now I gotta find it again. I can't aim this stupid thing. What the? F <laughs> this is dumb. How am I supposed to do this? This is not cool. I'm tired of these things. Because all they do is take me way far away from wherever the Hades condo is. I do have an idea of how I can maybe go about this. Is to like build a roof on the top and then use that. It'll take a while. Yeah, like, it only goes one or two directions, too. It doesn't let me go and uh, have it turn. It can only go, like... And the Hades condo is never in that direction! Like, I can't... Oh, I don't like this setup at all. This is, like, cool. <laughs> This is horrible. I don't even think you can hit it until you actually defeat their stupid pony whatever it is. I don't want to just let my character die now. <laughs> I'm <getting> upset. <laughs> Let me see. I don't need this here. Yeah, I don't know how this is supposed to work, but like, I'm never going to be in the right exact position. It's not like it's in a predictable spot every time. And if I try to build it now, it's going to keep throwing me off with its wing parts. Oh, it's like it turns. <sighs> this ain't going to work. I don't know how it would predict where it would be. This thing takes too long. Wow. That was easy. It's not enough, is it? It must be higher. Are you serious? You threw me all Son of a biscuit. <laughs> yeah, destroy my town, why don't y'all? Just let it start me over. This is horrible. Kill me! Y'all destroyed my place. Return me back to before my land was destroyed. Yes before my town was turned into, like, a mess. Return. Okay, so now that I actually know how that battle goes, because I was like, how do you set up for it when you, it's like, you don't know where it would be. Mm -hmm. So knowing that, one, I have to make a way for me to go up, so. I'm just I'm gonna leave this spot. have roofs up here. Mm -hmm. And I'm just gonna have to carry around the ballistas or make way more than I need. areas up top to attack from. Maybe I should make stairs for the mosses just to climb up. So I only worry about them upstairs. The first time I fought like the chapter one boss too, I didn't know what I was doing. I totally destroyed my town.
It's like they don't give you as much nice ways to build better walls yet, huh? Or should I say at all for this chapter? It's kind of unfair. That or I miss some quests to get better options, recipes. Ooh, this does suck. <laughs> I hate them! I mean, I guess the only thing to think is I'm gonna line them around and hope I... Since we know that there's mainly the back that they attack, let's just protect the back. Wall's gonna disappear. Mm -hmm. I think it's like just outside the barrier. Mm -hmm. At least this wall will be around. I'm looking armored up enough. <laughs> stay in one area as much as possible. What are you doing? <laughs> Oops. 
spells, you messed up my pattern. possible which is unfortunately one I need more wood Stop following me up here. <laughs> 
trying to build my fort of insanity. Exactly enough. Mm, a little bit. Just enough land there. <laughs> I'll keep this one with me then. All right, let's do this crazy battle. <laughs> Yes. Can I still say that she's dumb for saying doing this to Devon? And I could have multiple people manning all the different ballistas instead? <sighs> <sighs> Alright. I'm ready to get this over with. I'm, I'm not having fun with this one. <laughs> I hope that wall's enough to just keep the like, lane at me down. So we're concentrating on just trying to shoot this stinky bird. <laughs> Go away! Leave me alone! I really did climb up on him. Oh no! <laughs> that was super lame. Now I gotta climb all the way back. This may not been... I probably should have at least put ladders and stuff. In case that happened. <coughs> Yuck. Okay, at least food. Yeah. I guess if they can't get in from the back, they just come in from the other sides. That is what it is. This isn't horrible. Well, anyway, I am up here. I'm gonna shoot at this paper. <gasps> oh, I'm poisoned. Gross. Let's see. There we go. So these two seem to be the most useful for this battle. Based on what you see here, I'm in the wall. I'm antidote. Oh. Wait, wait, come on! Yay! This is it! Holy cow! <laughs> I found the right spot! 
That was actually good. I shot that flipper. Get back over there. is perfect. Huh? Boom! What then? Let's do this! <laughs> I'm gonna kick your flipping booty. I'm tired of you. Everything that you maybe have to do. And all the rooms I'm getting destroyed thanks to you. My back wall it was like near impenetrable wood. They sure as heck went after like the sides, huh? <laughs> it's okay. If if we win, I'm just gonna move on to the next chapter and they're just gonna have to deal with this on their own, right? <laughs> That's all that matters. I'm glad I found the right spot. <sighs> Thank you. You jerks. But my <laughs> I'm missing a lot of recipes that the other one. Oh, chapter half. Oh, what? What the heck? Whoa! Hold on! What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> they threw a whole tornado at me! You son of a biscuit! That's cheating! You make it so that way I have to go and climb all this way back up from there. Do a tornado. You tell me what the heck. Mm -hmm. I used to how I can protect myself from a tornado. Mm -hmm. Come on! Are you kidding me? Wait, aren't I using the item for pro- Oh. Cause I can only wear so many of those stinking rings at a time. It would be the one and I can't. You guys are wrecking my home, man. I don't care about this home. Yeah, I probably- If I knew that, I would've made a wall here. Really. Okay, screw this whole tornado thing. What the heck? I can't escape this tornado. Excuse me. That's some cheap moves, man. Because it makes sure that I can't get anywhere near the condor when he's resting because he threw a tornado at me. What a cheap thing. What the heck? Am I supposed to- Oh! There's no way to climb back up because these stupid freaking monsters won't stop destroying my town from the inside out. I ain't got time for you losers. <laughs> Nobody loves you. So bad. Can it please go back in the middle? I'm tired of these stupid like extra monsters. Like, stop being a coward and fighting this stupid bird. <laughs> A bunch of poison monsters. Mm 
This thing could be a little faster. <laughs> oh, come on. This isn't fair. This slows me down so much every single time. Ah, oh, and I have to keep building up a way to get back up. I keep okay, I literally just made that jerk. <laughs> oh my god, get off me. <laughs> get off me, shoot. <sighs> I feel every time I sometimes my desk for when I'm working. <laughs> Jeez, there's too many of these tornadoes. tornadoes. I am sick of these tornadoes. Seriously. That's some bull snap. And then the fact that he made all the land around me poisonous on top of it. And now he ripped my clothes off, that pervert. you're resting your wings now because you know that I can't get anyone near my building with the way you keep pushing me off. I'm gonna have to put you build my own barrier to stay up. I'm tired of these zombies, man. I hate this battle. <laughs> it's really annoying. Flip off! No one invited you, you loser! <laughs> I don't need y'all here. Yeah! I don't feel part of this. You ain't part of this. You're just a peon, okay? Better be in that spot again. Okay, let's do this. I'm tired of this guy. Take it down. It takes so long for me to get there. Like, I don't even move fast. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm just really slow. Everything's slow. I didn't do anything to it. How is this? I don't know. It's actually kind of more annoying when I'm stuck indoors now because I can't get up! You son of a biscuit! Everybody's gonna destroy my way to get out! <laughs> what is it? I can't. I can't even figure out to see what it says. <laughs> Man, they're freaking like too many monsters. That's ridiculously annoying. <laughs> Down flippity. <laughs> oh no! I did not rip off another part of my clothes. Dang coward. Come on! Why is this thing so slow? <laughs> I'm just beginning slower, so I only get like two hits in every time I actually do get up here in time. <laughs> Stay up here because every move is a knockoff move. I'm tired of these knockdown moves. <laughs> there. Jeez. Gotta build a wall just so I don't fall off. I guess I probably want a roof over my head because of this. <sighs> Freaking heck. 
I'm about to bang my stinking head. Just like destroying my stream. Telling my like, no tomorrow. I have no easy way to get back up. I don't even know what's where anymore. Ugh! <laughs> Go away! I hate all y'all! This is so frustrating! He is just disgustingly destroying my down. <laughs> well, this is not the best I, can. I don't care anymore. <laughs> when the destroyed is destroyed. Get all these damn things off me. I don't care. Nobody helps me. And I am having to deal with way more enemies, and I don't got no stinking, like, attack that actually works on this many freaking monsters, so, like, how the heck am I supposed to do this? And then, on top of that, they keep make destroying my path to get back up! <laughs> oh, that doesn't help me. I can't... I don't even cook anything. Any freaking armor. Is my sewing machine still around? Shoot. <laughs> Oh my gosh! I don't- I just wanna freaking- Yes! I have no armor now. I am completely nude. <laughs> Dog on purpose and strip me up. <laughs> Jeez. Yes, I know. Enough with it. Dying Pokemon sound effects. I need a way to get back up on my doggone boost. This is so annoying. I hate this so. Can I land in my- at least close to my freaking town? Stop it! Of course you're resting now. Oh, of course! I finally get back up, and it moves. <sighs> I'm trying to knock me off. I'm tired of your knock me off moves. You coward. Get your dang zombies off my lane. You don't have a stick <sighs> I really can't. Oh my goodness, if y'all not stop. Do I even hit it? I don't even know. Anymore. There's a stupid little tomato in here. I told you to put them in the wrong level. I guess if this messes up again, I know I, I just need that one ballista. And I just need to have some kind of cover and a way to get back up here. Seriously, there's no way to avoid the stupid tornado except for being under something. <laughs> but they keep destroying my path to get places. Holy cow. Oh. Please, thank you. Jerks. <laughs> And of course, it's not resting in the same spot. Great. I really hate this bird. <laughs> I am over it. Be like, I'm done. I'm not gonna be all savory anymore. Y'all have a ridiculous problem. <laughs> Alright, 
Yes. Got it. Except now the stinking bird is who knows where my way. Okay. Yay. Okay. We're almost there. Come on. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's so close! This barrier is like apparently what I need the most to do this. Man, they bring up another round of this. I'm getting tired of this guy. There's like no way not to get hurt here. <laughs> like, did all their attacks go through things? Yes! Please! Stop getting hurt. Alright. Go! Come on! <laughs> I want you dead! Are you kidding me? Okay. Please tell me it's dead. Oh. Thank you. I hate you. <laughs> that was really annoying. <laughs> I don't want any more sky battles. Yeah. Ha 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 ha. This town is completely and utterly destroyed. Yeah, our town's destroyed. <laughs> Oh, Julie, the Hades Condor is defeated! Yeah, I'm not fixing y'all's town. I'm leaving. <laughs> Praise be to the goddess. Truly, she does watch over us all. Now, the blight that pollutes our land can finally be eradicated for good. Thank you, my lamb. Thank you so very, very much. By the way, what's that cu curious crystal that you covered from the Condor? Do you think you could use your powers as a builder to craft into something that could clear the darkness from our sky? The recipe. It is transmutation. Does that still exist? Wow. Okay. <laughs> really? <sighs> okay. Let's go get trees. That would be the freaking wood that I used up for the ballistas. <laughs> Oh jeez. Hey, the teleportal room didn't get messed up. Oh my goodness, get off me! Alright, which one was it? The first teleportal that has the most wood, right? That I can get to so quickly. Yeah, they disappeared during the battle. Who knows where they were? Not getting killed by Condor, I tell you that. <laughs> some wood so we can get on with the last part. <laughs> I don't care about their town. <laughs> At least if I do need to replay this if I want to get the platinum trophy, I know that I need to make apparently an entire war room right there. <laughs> Just isolate myself in there. Social distancing. <laughs> <sighs> now because I don't really care that much. I just want to make this one thing, get it done, get out, and they can build their own town. 
I taught them all the skills they need. <laughs> Yeah, they did not give us, like, walls and stuff to actually take care of our place. This is not cool. <laughs> Alright, what do I need? I need to be able to... And this place is in, like, the worst shape ever. I don't think any rooms that are worth anything survived. <laughs> okay, what was I doing? Oh yeah, making wood. Here it is. As many as possible. Let's, go, let's get transmutation circle. <coughs> Horrific. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. While they're fighting in the middle of night, maybe I should just sleep and let them deal with. Oh, because my runes are broken. I can't do nothing now. You broke all my runes. Can't even sleep. Die. Is every single room destroyed? Oh. I have nowhere to sleep. I'm going to build up this place. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. Whatever. Good God is above. If I'm not mistaken, that's the legendary staff that can restore the light to the land. Geely, my land, take that staff to the banner of hope and offer it to the heavens. And let Ruby's fleet blessings shine down upon us once more. First, I need to get back my inventory. All this random crap keeps getting my inventory. This ballista and this earth. There's my stuff. Oh, they're fighting a war. <laughs> Wait, I can't even get back up on this. <laughs> Their town is disgusting now. Eh, whatever. I win! <laughs> Points. The town is just decimated. And I'm like, yep, their problem now. I did the thing. Isn't that how it really works, anyways? Like, usually, you know, heroes, they try to save everyone by fighting the big monster, but while they're in the process of fighting said big monster, the, the town gets destroyed. <laughs> Natural. <laughs> the light returns to Remoldar. Geely, my child, you have done well. Remoldar has been freed from the Dragon Lord's evil influence, and his people are now free to cleanse the land of the poisons that pollute it. However, your duty is not over yet. There are others who still suffer under the Dragon Lord's rule and await your succor. Praise be to the goddess! Look, Geely, the heavens are so so bright. That night, the people of Remoldar hold a modest banquet to celebrate Jili's victory and their freedom from the Dragon Lord's curse. Though the jubilant villagers enjoy the festivities, the thought of the friends they lost to this blight weighs heavily upon them all. All three of them. Everyone at the feast secretly steals themselves to the thought of the many afflicted still suffering throughout the land in need of help. Then morning comes. Keely, you have finally awoken. Where did I sleep? Cause, um, none of these are proper rooms anymore. Oh my, you don't look well at all. My poor little lamb, I think you may have had a bit, little bit too much fun last night. Tee hee hee. Was fighting the condor considered fun, or did we actually do something? <laughs> After spending all our lives with that darkness hangovers, I think that's the first time any of us have ever laughed so hard. But still, my grandfather, Garantia, seemed ever so remorseful last night. He seemed to want to apologize for anything and everything. Did something happen? Yep. Well, never mind. I think I know what might have made him have a change of heart. Tee hee hee. Yep, he loves you. Oh, one more thing, Geely. I saw a most curious sight this morning. I think I know where it is. 
there is a great shaft of light rising from the hills to the north and piercing high into the heavens. I imagine that's the sort of thing that might interest you. Perhaps you would like to go and take a look. Alright, let's find chapter 3! <laughs> and not get killed on the way there. Poison, right? Can I walk in this water? Nope. <laughs> or I can, but I get hurt. Who cares? I got healing items. I'm leaving. I'm out of here. <laughs> Child, the light you see before you is a portal to the next land you must free from the Dragon Lord's curse. The items and the knowledge that you have acquired in this place will not survive the journey. The moment you pass through this portal of light, you will lose everything. But Jili, my child, should it still be your will to rid this world of darkness, I bid you step into this swirling vortex without fear or regret, and be safe in the knowledge that I do watch over you, always. I'm almost tempted to start chapter 3 already. <laughs> Are you sure you want to leave this land behind and travel to the next island? Yes, let's just end it! Jaylee, must you really leave us? Yeah, I'm gonna, y'all y'all can build the town. I'm, I'm done with it. <laughs> I want to stop you more than anything, but I know that that would be mere selfishness, and selfishness is a sin. Nor would I wish to sour this moment by pleading with you to stay. For I know the role that you must play by Leia. Excuse me. You are to rid Alephgard of the darkness that infects its very heart, to cure it of the plague of shadow. Oh, I do beg your pardon. I'm being awfully poetic all of a sudden. Now remember to dress warmly, Jeevee. We can't have you catching a cold. And make sure you keep yourself well fed. Try to eat food that's healthy and nutritious. And remember to exercise too. And then, um, um. Oh, yes, Chili, it may not be much, but I've got a little something for you. Please take this with you. I don't want you fighting all those horrible monsters without it. Farewell, my lamb. Take care of yourself wherever you go. Didn't they just say I, I will lose everything? <laughs> Wonder how crazy the next chapter is. It's gonna be really hard, right? <laughs> This is getting hard. <laughs> oh, my score is gonna be horrible, right? Oh, I only had four deaths. It's not too bad. <laughs> I did one ch challenge. You can now build wooden furniture in Terra inc Incognita. Complete the chapter within 30 days. But you have to sleep a lot just to grow like the plants and stuff. <laughs> Repair the ruined roof. Yes, I did that. Obtain the crown ghouls. And complete all of the Lamus's puzzles. Interesting. Eh. Yeah, it is what it is. Maybe one day. <laughs> oh. Cole and Galem home. <sighs> A new island has been unlocked in Terra Incognita. New recipes have been unlocked in Terra Incognita. I haven't even looked at that mode. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this here, and next time we will explore the new chapter. I hope it's not as uh, chaotic as what we just experienced, but I'm sure it will be. <laughs> So, I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. This is Julie, signing off.